स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज वन पॉइंट फोर प्रैक्टिस से वन पॉइंट फोर सी प्रॉब्लम नंबर फर्स्ट इफ एन एज गोल टू फिफ्टी मीन्स आई एम राइटिंग यू एन ए इज इक्वल टू फिफ्टी एंड सेकेंड वैल्यू एन नंबर ऑफ ए यूनियन B is equal to twenty nine, and the number of A intersection B is equal to seven. Find number of B number of elements in B. How much? So here we know that we know that. ये नंबर ऑफ एलिमेंट्स इन यूनियन बी इज इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ एलिमेंट्स इन ए नंबर ऑफ एलिमेंट्स इन बी माइनस नंबर ऑफ एलिमेंट इन ए इंटरसेक्शन बी सो हियर एन इज गिवन एन दैट इज 15 एन बी फाइंड माइनस एन इंटरसेक्शन बी 7 And union is also given to you that is of twenty nine. So twenty nine is equal to fifteen minus seven divided by eight plus n of b. Therefore twenty nine minus eight is equal to number of elements in set b. So subtraction we get twenty one is equal to n of b. Therefore The number of elements in n of p is equal to twenty one. Now, see second problem. The solution of second problem here in a hostel there are one twenty five students means. The total total students in hostel that is a n union that is the total number of students in U set is equal to here one twenty five given to you second out of which eighty students drink tea. Let A be the number of students drink tea. Therefore, n of A is equal to eighty. Next, let. Sixty student drink coffee. That is B. B the number of students drink coffee. Therefore, the amount B is equal to sixty. And twenty student drink tea and coffee both. Therefore. Let E enter play. Therefore, the number of students, number of students, drink tea and coffee. That is what. Therefore, number of students the intersection between A intersection B into set value is given to you. That is a twenty. So therefore, to find here find the number of students who do not drink tea or coffee. Therefore, the number of students number. Of students do not.
ड्रिंक टी और कॉफी देर एन इंटरसेक्शन ए यूनियन बी इज बर्ड नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट ड्रिंक टी एंड कॉफी गिवन टू यू एंड हियर फर्स्ट यू फाइंड हियर दिस वे लेट एस यू फाइंड फर्स्ट हियर वी नो दैट वी नो दैट दैट इज दिन यूनियन बी इज गट नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट सी मी प्लस नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट बी माइनस नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट ई इंटरसेक्शन बी वैल्यूज हियर एन ऑफ ई इज गिवन टू यू दैट इज एटी प्लस दिस इज सिक्सटी बी माइनस ट्वेंटी हियर वन फोर्टी माइनस ट्वेंटी वैल्यू ऑफ दिस इज हियर वन ट्वेंटी एन ए इंटरसेक्शन बी so we want have here do not number of student do not drink tea and coffee therefore the number of students do not drink tea and coffee that is we have to find here the total students that is n of u subtract this value from n number of students in a union b is equal to this is 125 n of u is equal to 125 this value already calculated here that is 120 subtract this we get here part so this is the number of students do not drink tea and coffee let us start next problem here now now problem number third solution now here in a competitive exam 50 student pass see in exercise 1.4 problem number third in competitive exam 50 students passed in english And 60 student pass in mathematics. 40 student passed in both the subject. Now none of them have failed in both the subject. Find the number of students in this. So here, in a competitive exam, the number of students, the number of students pass. in english therefore n of e is equal to 50 and 60 students passed in mathematics the number of students passed in mathematics therefore n is the number of i am taking here of m m for mathematics e for english here is given to you 60 next forty student passing both the subject the number of students passed in both the subjects so therefore number of students e intersection and is given to you for this one so we know the formula for that so here we know that that is the number of students that is e union b is equal to n of e plus n of m minus 
number of students e intersection r is a is given that is 50 this is 60 and this is 40 so here this is 110 and this is minus 40 we get 70 this is the answer so e union b is equal to this way. now let us see uh, problem number 3 i am giving the hint of this problem now see first you find the value of u that is a universal set so universal set means pick all the elements in this u see a set x y and z yam yam this again take this p q r and these two yes and t this is called as a universal set again take the value of a how many elements contains in a this is the circle how many elements are here x y z and these two also because these two elements are contains in a and b both so when you are taking the elements of a take this x y z m and n so here x comma y comma z and this m comma n now b take the elements in the set of b b p q r so p q r and this m n n also contains in set b so we want here C, A means and B. First class, this is the value of first, this is the value of second, this is the third. Find A union B. A union B means take the combined elements of set A and set B. So here A, don't take repeated, that elements is coming twice take only once because the elements cannot be repeated so here x x y z c m n and these both elements are repeated here take only once so here n comma n the p the q and the r fourth u with a dash how to find a dash means compare a with u so when you are finding the a dash i am giving the solution up here don't disturb here now see first write u then write e and from that comparison i know you see write for x y z m and, and p q r s and t e means here x y z m n now find a dash how to find c those elements present in a cut from u c x x don't take cancel this this cancel y y cancel z z cancel m m cancel n n how many shall we need p q r s and P. This is the answer of A. Remaining problem you solve as it is. Okay?